Hello, people who are not me, and and welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Trigger. In the last part, uh, we ended up going through the gate to get out of the the future, but now we are here, and now we are somewhere. But um, can I? Oh. So now we gotta figure out where we are. Let's talk to this old man here. Oh, Morgan! <coughs> what do you mean, guests? And where are we? Why, this is the end of time, of course. All lost travelers in time wind up here. Now, where are you from? Ah, uh, we're from Guardia Kingdoms. Circa 1000 AD. I come from 2300 AD. 2300, wow. <laughs> when four or more beings step into a time warp, the, cons the conservation of time theorem states that they will turn up. At the space time coordinates of least resistance. Here. Disturbances in the space time continuum have increased recently. Far too many folks are just popping in here. I'd throw in a Back to the Future reference, but one, I think it's been overdone, and two, um, copyright issues. Um, all done. Yay, notes on my TV screen, whatever. <laughs> That's better. Full screen mode activated. <clears throat> anyway, I, fe I fear something is having a powerful effect on the very fabric of time. Which means one of us has to remain here. Stay here? Alone? It is pretty bleak here. But not to worry, all time periods connect here. You can visit your friends whenever you wish, but you can never travel in groups greater than three. Aww! So one of us must stay. Will it be Trunks? Hmm... For now, I'm going to keep it like this. Please come for me whenever you need me. So there you have it. Don't forget, press the square button to switch party members. I think that's Y in the Super Nintendo version. How do we go back to our time? You see those lovely pillars of light? Those hook you to the different eras. Once you've been through a gate, you can always use it to come here. Use a gate from here. Step onto the light and press X button. But beware of the gate which leads from this from that bucket. Which bucket? This one? Hey! What? What? Don't be in such a rush. Before you go, take a peek inside the room behind me. Oh, sure, why not? Darn it. Oh well. <laughs> and here's this. Who's this guy? What are you looking at? I'm Speccio, the master of war. I've been I've seen all kinds of battles from here. He's covered wars. Holy crap. <laughs> How do I look to you guys? You look weak, sir. I see. Let's put it this way. If you're strong, I look strong. If you're weak, I look weak. Hey! You are strong of will. Oh, cool. That's why the old one let you through. Long before you were born, there was a kingdom where magic flourished. Everyone there could use it. Oh, cool. But in time, people began to abuse their power. It got so bad that no one was allowed to use magic except wizards. Hmm. But you have it. Determination, I mean. Magic needs power of the heart. It needs inner strength. I need to give him a nerdier voice. Magic is divided into four types. Lightning, fire, water, and shadow. You with the punk hairdo, you're lightning. The one with the ponytail is water. The one with goofy glasses is fire. Not just magic, but everything is based on the balance of these four powers. Think magic and start from that door. Walk clockwise around the walls of my room three times. Don't lose track now. Okay. 
Oh, but you do have to walk. So start here and just start walking. If you run, it doesn't work. <laughs> I remember watching Nintendo Capri Sun's Let's Play of this, and he fast forwarded this because he spent like 10 minutes walking counterclockwise. It was great. <laughs> Hopefully, I don't do the same thing. I am. I am openly going to admit this. I suck at directions of knowing what like clockwise and counterclockwise are. Thankfully, I did it. Very good. Ipso facto, minimo magico, and you get the spirit bomb or magic. And. Videl learns to use magic, and Luca's on fire, and she seems way too happy about that. Bulma. Bulma learns to use magic. That's the first time I've actually used their original name. So, fortified with magic. Want to try it out? Sure. And you can fight Specchio. If you can beat him, you get stuff. He's not easy, I'll tell you that right now. See? Not easy. You can only hurt him with magic, which is very, very use, which is very convenient considering you just learned it. But he can kick your ass like that. Mm. Don't worry, if you lose this. Don't worry if you lose this fight, because there's no penalty for losing it. In fact, I'm probably nowhere near strong enough to actually do it. If I can, then more power to me, but... It's looking like I'm not going to. Nope, I just got owned. Don't feel bad about that. I'm so low level right now that I'm not supposed to be able to beat him. <laughs> I win. You guys are too much. Bring newcomers. Why not? See, I'll show you right here. See, and you get all your stuff back. Um, but for right now, it's just because I have no magic defense, pretty much. I mean, I can get more magic defense later. And I'll tell you this right now. Um, Specchio's form changes every ten levels. So, I'll try and remember to come back here when I'm like level 19 or so, and that way I'll be able to kick his ass. Hey. Yes? Well, well, people who lived long ago all enjoyed such powers. Now I know you are itching to go ripping back and forth through time, but first you need to return to your era, and you must hurry. The longer you remain here, the harder it'll be to change that which must be changed. Stop by whenever you're in the area. Sure, why not? Um, but... But before that, let's... He wants to see newcomers. So let's change the music to be Robo. Or 8. I'll get better at remembering their unique names, I promise. But well, Speckio wants to meet new people, so... That's the biggest toy I've ever seen! Hey, you're not alive, are you? You've got great strength, however, since I can't measure your inner character, I can't give any magic to you. 
Aw, but your laser weapons will suffice. They can inflict shadow type damage. Cool. So eight can. So eight's techs are considered shadow type. Cool. But let's get Videl back in here. Cause I like her. Oh, uh, what am I at? Ten and a half minutes? I can go a little bit longer. So, the old man said to go back to our time. So let's go back to, oh shoot, but I didn't want to go back to that just yet. Hold on. There's something I missed a little bit, a little bit ago. And what the heck? Why are there monsters here? Oh well. Um, I forgot one teeny little thing. I gotta go back to where we were. I gotta go back to the future. Yes, I need the reference. Crap. You know you had to say it eventually. You know I had to say it eventually, viewers. Anyway, let's go back to the future. Damn it, stop saying that. But, <clears throat> because there was something here that I forgot. There it is. You get a power tab. That's what I meant to go get. <laughs> but now we gotta go back to 1000 AD. Uh, was it Medina? 65 million BC? Holy crap! No! No, I'm not going that far! We'll go back to home. We'll go back home. Medina Village, 65 million. Good lord! Holy crap! And what are you doing here? Did you people just come out of the closet? Get out of here! Yes, yes, we came out of the closet. Shut up. What do you think you are, coming and going out of our closet at all hours? Scram! Fine. Wait a sec. Medina Village was founded by the ancestors of the mystics who lost a war to human beings. Most mystics hold a grudge against humans. Be careful. There's an odd man who lives near the cave in the mountains to the west. You might enjoy a chat with him. Thanks. Why are you being so nice? Mystics aren't supposed to be to get along with humans. Humans fought the mystics over 400 years ago. My motto is, forgive and forget, but not many seem to agree with me. Well, you're awesome, dude. You're awesome. More people need to be tolerant like you. Oh, also, um... Little update! I got Kid Icarus Uprising for my 3DS. The game is freaking awesome. I love it. But anyway, um, I'm see, I'm at 14 minutes now. I think I'm gonna stop here for this part. And now we're in the Village of Magic, or the chapter called the Village of Magic. So next time, we'll figure out exactly what is going on here. See you guys next time.